We've all seen those wonderful videos with the special effects. The red flames, the green flames, the yellow flames. And the director calls upon the chemist to try and do this work. So let's have a look and see how we can use some of these chemicals to produce these special effects. <laughs> I have some different chemicals, some lithium that burns with a red flame and some potassium which burns with a lilac flame and some disodium tetraborate that burns with a green flame. Using these we can create all sorts of interesting effects. The green flame called dragon's breath. Now, You've probably done a flame test where you put a small amount of one of these substances in on a Bunsen burner, put it in a Bunsen burner on a piece of wire and you get the flame. But that's not really quite good enough for some of these better effects. So what we're going to do is we're going to do it a slightly different way. We're going to take one of these chemicals and I'm going to take a small amount and I'm going to place it on here a watch glass and to this watch glass I'm going to add a small amount of methanol. Now methanol burns with a clear flame which we can't really see and We've also got it mixed here with some lithium chloride. Let's look at the flame first. And it's virtually invisible. The only thing I can do is put my hand over the top and I can feel the heat of the flame. Whereas if we try it with the lithium, you can start to see the red flame, almost crimson flame, of the lithium burning. Now, we can, we'll do this again and try and make it a bit clearer for you by turning out the lights so that we can just look at the flame. there you can probably see the flame of the lithium much clearer this crimson red colour. What I'm going to do is the same thing but this time I'm going to do it with some potassium chloride. This burns with a lilac flame. Which is quite hard to see. And so when we get this one going again, we're going to dim the lights so that you can see it. Just mix it round. And let's light it, see what happens. Here we go. see the lilac flame of the potassium. But the most fun one to do of course is to try and have a look at the dragon's breath. This is disodium tetraborate and I'm going to take a small amount of this and 
again we're going to add some methanol and then let's see here's dragon's breath you can see the green flame and also the yellow flame the yellow flame of the sodium and the green flame of boron the yellow is quite strong and it masks to a certain extent some of the boron but we'll have a look we'll try it once more they sometimes burn better the second time because the boron here has been better distributed There we have the green flame that is Dragon's Breath. better to see than probably the ordinary flame test but good fun nevertheless see you next time